welcome back to Strategies with Sasquatch. I'm your host, Josh. We're back in the long dark. This is the Stalker Tales. And, uh, yeah. Let's see, where the heck are we? I'm pretty sure we're at the plane crash. And let me just... Oh, yeah. We've got... We got some stuff. It's been a little bit since I played this. I did some live streams. I've done some other videos, but it had been a moment since I have done any of this, so I wanted to, wanted to keep doing the Stalker Tales, because it's been fun. There we go. It's also, like I said, it's been a little bit since I've done any of this playthrough, so adjusted the volumes just a tiny bit. I turned the overall volume up from 75 to 80%, so hopefully that wasn't a bad change. Okay, got some six guts, cured maple, cured birch. Got a knife, hatchet, hacksaw. Look at all these goodies. Tools. That's a lot of charcoal. It might be more charcoal than I actually need. Lots of bullets. No guns. I'd like to get that bow and get some arrows. But I have to forge to do that. I don't have a hammer, I don't think. Yeah, no hammer. I think the last time I was considering going to HRV, because then I could try to go for a moose hide satchel. What is this? Is this boiled water? Okay. Is getting too heavy to carry. Right, so I got my coffees. Lots of stuff. I think I should just put some food down. Because I don't think I'm going to need... Oh my goodness, I got so many things. Am I not wearing clothing? I am. I'm so sorry. I'm out of it. I have not played the save in so long. So this is... Ooh, that could get a mend. I'll just drop this. Drop those things. Yeah, that is a lot of clothing. And I don't really need them. So... Boots are not in great shape. I mean, there's definitely mending to be done. I just don't have the materials. I guess I don't have a sewing kit anymore, do I? I've got some fishing line. What else did I have here? A little bit of extra stuff. Got food, water. Oh my goodness, I have so many extra clothing items. probably drop this food outside. It's nice and warm. It's just really windy. Just drop these off. I think I could just drink one of these. That would be fine. Eat some chips. Make myself thirsty. So I can have some more, I suppose. I'd like to get rid of that soda. It's not going to go bad on me, but it is kind of heavy, and I don't like, I don't like the red, the red, uh, percentage. Yeah. There, that's better. Leave this water here. I'll pick up the other water I left just inside the cave here, because I put it in a weird spot. I'm not sure why I put it where I did, but... I don't I think I'll have to leave most of this stuff behind. Where did I put that water? Here it is. Okay, time to get a little bit more cloth. I probably will rip those shoes apart so I can fix the boots that I have. I'll have to look at the log and see where the heck I've been. I know I was in Ash Canyon and Timberwolf Mountain. I don't remember where I spawned. So let's take a look. 
Okay, spawned in Timberwolf. Stayed at the summit for quite a little while. Crystal Lake, went to the cave. Oh, that's right. Then there was the, the massacre on the lake. Then went to Ash Canyon. So that was fun. And then I recently got out of Ash Canyon. And now we're in Pleasant Valley. Okay, good. So I've got quite a bit of the world left to explore. And I didn't really even get too much of there's still some stuff in each of the maps that I've went to already like Hush River Valley or sorry Ash Canyon I, I missed a few spots Timberwolf Mountain here or uh, over there I didn't quite get everything from that but I got enough hockey jersey is kind of cool now, where did those shoes go I think I see them right here Actually, I might take this ragged t-shirt because that's going to be cloth. Yeah, both ragged t-shirts. Ragged windbreaker. I got plenty of food and water, so... And I still got those warm coffees sitting on the fire. Probably should go to sleep here soon because I don't want the whole night to go by, but... Might as well get these things done. Oh, there goes the wind. Now, am I in the outer part of the cave? I mean, this is warm enough part. What is our warm benefit anyway? Plus 25 degrees. Yeah, we're doing good. We're in great shape. I should fix this. Oh, I do have a sewing kit. Okay, actually, that's fine. I don't want to use too many of the sewing kits because I'm not sure how much crafting I want to do. It would be nice to get some rabbit stuff, but I don't think I have... Yeah, this is something I would definitely want to use the sewing kit for because it takes almost an entire extra hour. Let's let drink the soda. It is so quiet out there now. Get rid of this. Hopefully this doesn't poison me. I don't think it will. Okay, good. Mending skill for me is still not very good. I think we're level one. So that was lucky. Yeah, mending level one. So the chance of failing is at its highest. Ski pants, or snow pants rather. And then we'll repair this one. Yep. Oh, come on. Okay, I guess I used the sewing kit that time. That's awesome. All fine, all good. And now I should sleep. Oh, sorry, I hit the microphone there. We'll just go for five. I've got, like I said, I got the coffees. There's going to be a lot of coffees. Or wait, how many coffees do I currently have? Wasn't it an insane amount? Like something like 30 or something? 25 and 20, uh, 64 coffees. Yeah, I think I can... I think I can splurge a little. Alright, there's going to be more cloth. I'll leave all this stuff here. The hatchet, is this in bad shape? Compared to the one I have, yeah. And then how many flares? Oops, sorry. Three flares. Okay, that's good. We'll leave all this stuff. What about the firewood? I don't really have too much of that. Oh, plenty of matches, though. Very good. Alright. Well, there's no time like the present. Oh, I have a bow. Don't remember having a bow. I think I will take one of these waters. Maybe I will eat. If it's not in bad shape. Oh, that's 100%. Uh, I think I'll leave that. Ooh, definitely don't want the terrible food. Let's risk this. Some vegetarian frozen meal. Alright, very good. 
Oops. It's been a little while since I played, so... I did not watch back my other video. I must have not taken this food. I don't think I want to touch that deer just in case I... Wait, did I take it? I did. Okay, nothing to harvest. Very good. Oh, I've got an idea. I'm pretty sure somewhere very close by there is a bunker. So it might be worth trying to find that. I do have the flare gun in case I come across a bear. Let's see if I can scoot up this. There we go. Come on. Ups a daisy. Really? There we go. I'm pretty sure it's like right over here. Oh, oh, I thought that was going to get hurt. I don't remember exactly where it is. I'm pretty sure it's very close by. Just go up the hill a little bit. Yeah, I don't think it'd be down. I think it's up over here. Maybe right up here? Ooh, I could be mistaken about exactly where it is, but I'm pretty sure it's somewhere very close to this plane crash. I am... Ooh, a wolf. Okay. There it is. There it is. Very good. Maybe I can get this wolf. I'm not sure if it heard that or not. I don't see it. Alright, whatever. I don't want to mess around too much. Now this is most likely empty. So, I don't think I'll find... I might not find anything in here, really. Ooh, a wooden shelf. Interesting. A bed, a box, a uh, medical container with nothing in it. This is probably empty. Yeah. Well, that's okay. This is a safe spot. Other than the wolf right outside. Okay, nothing in there. Cannot start. Oh, that's right. Wrong button. All right, back outside. Hopefully that wolf doesn't see me right when I get out, but we'll deal with it if we have to. Cooking skill is still pretty low, so I'm not going to risk parasites, not when I have that much food in my pack. Come on, loading screen. Yeah, I know, Astrid. I'm sorry. I got you out here without your full rest. Hmm. I don't frequent this area of Pleasant Valley very often. Isn't Three Strikes over this way? I very, very rarely go to Three Strikes. I think uh, during the cartography run that I was doing, I've been there, and then I'm pretty sure in Winter Mute, what is it, Chapter 3, they send you to Three Strikes. Hmm, I'm pretty sure there's a, what is it, Pensive Pond is over here before Three Strikes. Again, not as familiar with this side of the map. Maybe I should do... I should be doing this. Y 
yeah, that's not going to reveal very much, so I'll have to just continually do that every so often. I will take the sticks, because my fire... Uh, firewood situation is pretty low. Hello, rabbit. I don't want to go out of my way for stuff. I'm sure I'll find enough. Ooh, what is this one? Of course it's not. Alright. I thought that was, uh... Crows indicating some sort of frozen something. Oh, let's not get hurt. Nice. I want to go up. I love going in the back area of these maps, especially if I'm not playing Interloper or Outer Loper or, or No Goa. <laughs> this is definitely one of my favorite things to do on the lower difficulty levels. Just explore. And do things like charcoal. Well, we're starting to reveal a little something. Alright, I do hear crows that are not the ones that just flew by. At least I don't think they were. Oh, shucks. They might be on the other side. Hello, another rabbit. I need to find a place to rest. Nice. I think that's three strikes right there. All right, let's just do this. Oh, wrong one. I don't want to place the... Oops, yep. All right, that was a bad reveal. I think this is the edge of the map, though. Well, for better or for worse, I might be able to get up there, but I don't think there's anything really... Not much worth... Exploring... Okay, come on. Give me those sticks, please. Thank you. I do need a forge because I need more arrowheads. I don't ha I don't know if I have a hammer though. I can't remember finding a hammer. It'd be another good reason to go to Hush River Valley, but that is quite a ways away. Oh, hello, dear. Wow, that was a very loud vehicle. My windows are not open. Do I have tea? I have... I have some. I got lots of antibiotics. Alright, not too worried about it. It's good to know that there's reishis over here, though. Oh, here comes the wind. Run away, little bunny. So is there anything in this place, I wonder? Ooh, another hatchet. It's in better shape than the one I have, so I'll move it over. Because I know there's a fire pit, right? Oh, is there a person? Where is there a person? Oh, it's a deer. Ooh, cool. I wonder if I can drop any of this gear. Yes, we will. We'll get in here and we'll drop some of this stuff. Don't worry, Astrid. We'll drink a bunch of water. Oh, look at this. Two snares. Very cool. I think I'll leave those. Fresh cooked rabbit. Gamey cooked rabbit. Gamey cooked venison. What is this? What is that? I'm at a loss for words. I don't know what what that's about. I'll just leave it here for now, I guess. I don't really want to... I don't want to do too much. Another bedroll, whetstone, little scarf. Nobody needs this anymore. Yeah, we're actually going to maybe take that. 
peaches, lots and lots of stuff. Now, is this wind protected, I wonder? If it's 100% wind protected, I can leave this bedroll here. It should be fine. And the extra hatchet. Oh, so many, so much stuff. Alright, the firewood. I might leave the firewood here. Yeah, you can have a piece of coal and some tinder and one of these things, a couple of these. Nice. Alright, time for some coffee. I'll leave some water. And there's food right there. So if ever I come back... There'll be stuff here. Nice. Yeah, still pretty encumbered. I know there's a cave around here somewhere. I think it's on the other side of the field over that way. I remember Murph was doing... Well, I forget which run it was. He was doing something, something cool and he was way out here. And the weather was being very unkind. But there was a... I remember him finding or looking for a cave. It was something like that. What is this? Another poor soul. Lots and lots of rabbits. Right, I got plenty of feathers. I can spare them. Now, if I keep circling this way, does that lead me to, what is it, uh, the long curve? Is that what it's called? Ooh, is, is this fog? Are you going to fog over for me? I'm glad I got the, uh, use the charcoal just in time for that then. Let's just, oh, not what I meant get one more of these out because if it lets me I'll try to mark this map where this cave is and I think the cave is right here that body that was in the field I think maybe was the one that was over here before the fog's not too bad where is this cave here we go alright nice I was able to do it good if the fog is too thick, it doesn't let me. I get, or it won't let. It doesn't work. So it might be coal in here. Or nothing. Okay, got it. Nothing at all. She's even on a stalker. This cave has nothing. Got it. did pick up a book. Maybe that's what I'll do. I'll drink another coffee and I'll read a book. Try to pass some time because I should be able to get through the, the night in this cave without too much concern. As long as I'm not too tired. Yeah, I'll make some more coffee. That's not an issue. Lots of crackers. Maybe I should have brought some of that airplane food. Oh, I don't need that. I need the water. Well, either way, it's fine. I can start a fire and make some water if it gets really, really bad. Alright, perfect. Time to sleep. Not really concerned in, in the slightest about a blizzard with plus 24 or 25 degrees, whatever the right number is. Plus 26. Oh yeah, because I fixed up some stuff.
I hate doing this, but that's such a nice, odd, like, that's a nice clothing item. It's not as good as the balaclava, but it is still a very nice clothing item, so. But I do need the cloth because I didn't, I don't have very much. I don't need to fix anything at the moment. I do need water, though. Just sleep for another little bit, and we'll keep moving. I can make some some water when I need to. Oh, what a nice morning. Oh, it's still a little chilly, but that's okay. Yeah, that's actually a good idea. It's saying that, like, the the red, like, when I when I take this out, it's the little red square button that says switch. That would be uh, white if, if I had the fire-hardened arrows. Okay, let me see if I can get around here. Oh, that looks like a trap point of no return perhaps let's see can I get across this should let me as long as I don't fall all right nice just in case there's a bear know that there's a bear around here somewhere. Right? Maybe? Yeah, look at those trees. That is so cool. Oh, that hurt. Oh, no. Ow. I knew that was a mistake. I just sort of walked off like it was no big deal. I just fixed those boots. I'm pretty sure it went after the boots. fine. It's not really that bad. Is there a hammer in black rock? Probably. Ooh, what is this little secret corner? Where there's a maple. That's cool. And some cattails over there. I didn't know that. I think I'll leave the maple. I'll leave the cattails. Be nice to come back some other day and have things be here. I hear those wolves in the distance. I've seen some other people playing recently and I guess there's a trick to hunting the bear. If you have a lit torch or a lit flare, the bear will stop at it if you're not like right on top of the torch. It'll act like a fire. I, I don't know how to explain it. I haven't done it yet, but it would be an interesting thing to try to Try to figure out how to do. Is there anything up here? Oh, a birch. Sorry, I had to itch my ear there. Jeez, this is such a large map. I'll leave the saplings again. I'm pretty sure there's no guarantee that where I'm finding saplings will be saplings on every single run for Stalker. And I'm almost certain that the sapling spawn locations are different for each difficulty level. Well, maybe not specifically because I think Pilgrim basically has just an immense amount of, of sapling spawns. Alright, so this is... 
interesting. I don't know what's the point of this area. Probably, eh, probably could get a snow shelter down. If I really needed to, that is. I don't know why I would want to. Oh, there's the bear. Do we want to try to hunt a bear? Hey, we are way away from anything, though. Like, I, I don't know where I would try to bring the meat or the, the hide or the guts. There's... I guess there's got to be a cave. Oh, right here is a bear cave, huh? Is this the bear's cave? Well, we're going to stop by and say... Oh, yeah, definitely the bear cave. Okay. I don't think there's anything in here. I think sometimes there might be, but... I've seen some people do one of these things. Oh, it might drop me. Crap. There's a way to get up here. Here we go. If you get up here to this spot, I don't think the bear can get you. It's like if you were to put your bedroll down and like start a fire or something. Maybe you probably start a fire after the fact, but like one of these sort of things. The bear will come in here. Well, according to what I've heard, the bear will come in here and it might just lay right down and you'll know it'll never know you're here. I've not tested that, but I heard it from a source that I would definitely trust information from. Because they themselves had done it. I don't think I'm going to wait around for the bear to come back, though. Ooh, I hear a wolf. Now, what is over there? Is that... Is that the homestead? I think that might be the homestead. Oh, there's so many bears. Is this the... Okay, so there's this bear that wanders, like, quite a ways. And then there's another bear underneath the tower right over there. Oops, sorry. Underneath, down here, there's another bear cave. Just going to try to get a little bit more mapping done. Oh, shucks. I should have mapped the bear cave. I meant to do that. Whoops. That's okay. I know it's there. And then down here... Oh, that's the other fun thing, right? Again, this is not necessarily a interloper or higher str uh, strategy, but... I might have said it before as well. If you run... Like, you sprint until you can't sprint anymore... And you get just about as far as you can get. And then you can stop. And if you're doing the, the markings, by the time you're done, your sprint meter, meter should be fully recharged. Yeah. So I don't want to spend too much time just mapping everything. Where are those crows? Oh, here we go. I saw this... Karen is I think it is a Karen. I know at one point I said I thought it was a Karn, but Karen. Karen? Papa. He thought it was alright here. What does that mean? Ooh, a torch? That's probably a hundred percent torch, right? Well, this stuff will come in oh handy. yes, mega torch. Nice. Oh, don't worry, I'll give him I'll give him his feather. Just want to look and see. Oh, be uh, beef jerky is nice. That is a lot. A lot of stuff. Oh, come on. So yeah, this is where I would go to get to, what is it, Keeper's Pass South? Which leads to Keeper's Path North? 
which then leads to oh black rock it itself oh interesting you can see the vehicle but i think that the vehicle that's just on the other side of this yeah so that goes to keeper's path south and that place isn't too bad. There's a lot of cattails. Well, maybe it's Keeper's Path North that is not too bad. There's not... I don't think there's... Correct me if I'm wrong. I don't think there's predators in Keeper's Path North. But the South, Keeper's Path, has quite a few wolves. I know, Astro. Don't worry. We'll give you some coffee if we have to. I, no, don't have any more. No more prepared, that is. No, I'd like to get up to Signal Hill. Not Signal Hill, is it? Signal Hill. Okay. Maybe there will be a revolver up there. A s perhaps a stim. Maybe a hammer. If there's a hammer up there... Oh, nice. another flare. That's nice. If there's a hammer, that'll be great. Because then I can... Because I can always go back to Hush River Valley at some other time. I do want more arrows, because I'm... I can rely on firearms if I find them, but I wouldn't... I haven't needed to, and I would rather have the bow. Cool, so there's a rabbit here. It's just on the... Behind that little hill there, I saw it. Looks like there might be another one. But if you can cut through this way and go around and then come up to the... To the back of... Signal Hill up there. I just want to take a little... Oh, I can't get up there. Shucks. Okay, I won't go that way. We will go this way. I know, sprain risk. I thought I saw a second rabbit, but I think it was a stick. Or a branch. Something, something like that. But just keep doing this. <laughs> I'll have to get some more charcoal. Definitely going to need to make more water, so that'll be maybe a two-hour fire. That'll give me another couple pieces, plus there's usually... Like, if you come up to a fire barrel or, like, a, a fire pit that is already... Or that you've never been to, but, like, has already made sometimes, the fire pits don't have them. But usually, like, the six-burner stoves or the potbelly stoves or... The fire barrels themselves will have at least one piece of charcoal already in it. So you don't even have to technically make a fire to get charcoal if you find one of those things. Like even the forge or like an ammo works workstation. Or sorry, like the the ammo crafting thing. The ammo forge, whatever the heck it's called. Any one of those will already have at least one piece of charcoal in it. Anything about now. Yep, we're gonna we're gonna drink. There's some more rabbits down there. That might be a wolf. What is that? Is that a log? Oh no, it's a wolf that has a rabbit. Okay. Fair enough. Oh, I've never been so hungry in my life. Yeah, I know. I'm sprinting around. I'm using all your energy, all your calories, all your hydration, all your charcoal. But that's good, because these charcoal were sort of weighing me down. Oh, that's a great reveal. Look at that. Cool. All right, just in time for this weather to start really changing. I'll grab just a couple more sticks. Because I dropped a bit of my... Well, most of the fuel off in that in that cave. Come here. At, what was it? Three Strikes Cave? Or at Three Strikes itself, rather. Yeah, this is going to blizzard. Almost sure. Almost certainly. With the way it's changing right now, I don't expect it to take very long to really kick up into a blizzard. Some more stones. I should be fine on stones. I have like two. I have not been hunting rabbits because no need. Later, depending on how far this run goes, Signal Hill. Let's just do this. 
quickly now before it really blizzards. All right, so that I don't see the name. I think it's there somewhere. Usually if you do the charcoal, you have to wait for the name of the location to pop up and then that would be like if you were trying to go for cartography, you would need to be at the named location. Yes, but you would also it would not necessarily uh count if you don't have let me see here sorry I'm trying to think and, and do at the same time and that's a bad decision on my part <sighs> anyway you could charcoal think you're at the right location and not get it because you were like one or two steps from it saying you're at said location already so I guess that's something to keep in mind Eat these bad chips. Now, do I have a can opener? I don't think I do, but I think it's because I decided it wasn't really necessary to hold a can opener because I've got the, the knife and the hatchet and, like, so many whetstones. I'm pretty sure I left some whetstones behind somewhere. But let's try not to burn these. Wind shaded at the moment, so that's good. Not really much else to do. I suppose I could make some bandages. That wouldn't be the worst idea. Oh, I've got four. No, no, no. We can take a little bit of tired condition loss. Just eat this. There's probably lots of food inside, actually. Let me just walk in there and see if... You know, we've got stuff to drink, Astrid. Come on now. Just want to look for the food. Here we go. Tomato soup, more peaches, crackers, herbal tea. Oh, water. That's probably half a liter. Yep. Anything in there? No. Military coat. I already have one of those, and it's in great shape, so I'll just leave that one. Ooh, combat boots are nice. Worn combat pants. I'll take the gloves. I'll take it. And the pain pills. I'll search this. Oh, lantern fuel, not bad. Just double check down here. Some more gloves. Wool mittens. I mean the ones that I have on are pretty good. Oh, another sewing kit. Lantern. This will come in handy. Yeah, I mean, I don't think I'm gonna take all of this stuff with me. I'll end up putting it in a locker or on the ground right next to the something that I'm definitely gonna look at, just to make sure that in the future I'll know. Hey, as soon as you walk in here, look at all this stuff. Man, this pack is getting kind of heavy. Yeah, I know it's very heavy. Make sure the bear isn't too close. Seven minutes until boiled. That's good. Yeah, definitely want to get the cooking skill out of these because I don't... I mean, I don't mind cheesing the, uh, the cooking skill if I'm not recording, but I don't think that... Again, it's all about necessity. It's not necessary for me... To do so. Also, it's a pain. It's a. It's extremely annoying to have to cook that many tiny pieces of food, and then at, after that, you have to you have to eat them. I mean, you don't have to eat them, but if you're ah, oh, whatever. It doesn't really matter. I just am not going to do it because that is not what I want to be, like, I don't want anyone to have to sit here and watch me do that. It's cool if that's, like, the main reason for doing a video is to specifically, hey, I'm doing this. Because to see if I can or how long is it going to take or can I do it in a certain amount of time, that's, that's fine. Like, I think that's kind of cool. 
All right, let's just refill this one. And then I can leave this one behind. Then I don't have to worry about the lantern fuel. I'll leave at least one torch, probably one of these, a sewing kit. Give me some water. Let's hurry up with this. Need to make some more coffee. Yeah, I hear those wolves going crazy. Well, they're not going crazy, but they're like... adamantly howling. Right, hot, hot, and hot. Let's take these, get our skill for it. Get a skill for the coffee. Might do just another couple of coffees because, if, again, I've got so many of them, I should have them ready to go. I'll probably have to do just a little bit more water. Just so I don't have to worry about it next time. I'm not even going to bother putting the, like, the hot teas on the thing because I don't think that's necessary either. Yeah, I know, we're hungry. I've got two lanterns and two 100% torches. Lots of water. There's still just a few more things to look at in this place, so... I'd like to at least loot it, consolidate whatever I find here into one of these here lockers. We'll use this lantern, because I'm going to leave it here, so... I mean, I don't have to have the extra lantern fuel, but I do want my... Oh, yes, a flare shell. That's fantastic. I do want the lantern that I bring with me to be full. Ooh, a rifle round. Now, is there... Ooh, a piece of cloth. A soda. Drink that right away. I see something else on the desk. What is that? What the hell is wrong with that? That thing is like the smallest, most crunched up little candy bar I've ever... I'll take it. <laughs> okay, fair enough. I mean, I'm not... Oh, there's a battery. I don't want that right now. It might, yes, ammo. There's some more lantern fuel. Firewood. Now, there's the stem. Good. I wasn't sure if it was going to be there. Because... Oh, oh matches. Nice. Oh, wool toque. Wow, this place has... Oops, sorry, sorry. That's... Punching the microphone on accident. This place has a lot of goodies. I think those matches... The container spawn matches are always a plus. I know that there are some places in... In this game that... Like a, a frozen corpse... Or like a backpack... Will always have matches... Depending on where... Where they are. Like the backpack, this when you leave uh, Mystery Lake and go into Mountain Town, into that climbing area, I'm pretty sure, at least on Interloper, I know that the cave that is down there that has the backpack, that backpack will always have matches. And then I think in Hush River Valley, there's a cave that has uh, an unfortunate soul that is frozen and I do believe that that person also has a book of matches on them at all times all right time to put some stuff away these boots are not in great shape but they're not bad that can go in there and I guess I don't really I don't want to fix those they're a little bit heavier. Yeah, I'll just I'll just have these ones as backup. They have less protection, so if I do get attacked by a wolf or a bear, there's a strong chance that I lose those gloves. Okay, we'll put this in here. Uh, this can stay. Definitely don't need four of those. I don't need four of these. Don't want to keep those, and I don't need these. You can have a whetstone. I didn't think about that. I should have been... Let's do this. No, I have the bow. 
I don't have arrowheads. That's what it is. But that's fine. I'll make these arrow shafts now. And then I'll have them. That'll reduce my weight just the tiniest little bit. I did not find a hammer here. So perhaps I should go next episode. More than likely, I'll find myself at the, the homestead, right? Is that what it's called? I am so sorry. I forever forget the names of places. Certain places I know and I will never forget. And other places I, st I know, but I always forget. That is a lot of arrow shafts. I didn't realize I already had so many. 41 rounds, 11 rounds. Enough guts to do whatever I need to. 44 arrows. A little bit of food. I think I'll eat the food that's heavier. It'll be good for hydration as well. So we'll eat the peaches. And we'll eat the other peaches. I think I'll maybe try to eat some of this. Gr no, I think I'll wait for this. I don't think I can get 500 calories. Yeah, no. And some water. Then I can drop these. Nice, nice. Very good. Oh, that's right. I forgot I'm exhausted. Been working too hard with, with the Astrid out here. I didn't get a full rest the night before. Okay. I think there's at least one more bit of maintenance that I wanted to accomplish. Or was there? Oh, four, four stems. That's significant. Oh, more firewood. The book is done. More matches. Right, let's see. Where is this locker? No, that's the empty one. There we go. I think I'll leave this match here. Yeah, that seems good. Now, what is my fire skill? It's got to be almost three, right? Yeah, it's pretty close. Okay, so I won't worry too much about tinder. Like, this this plus these should be enough. Wait, what did I do? I put one match in there. Well, <laughs> that's funny. I, I meant to put the entire book of matches, but I put one match. Oh, good stuff. Yeah, plenty of food. Alright, one more hour of sleep. And then I can eat... Oops, sorry. Good lord. I'm having a hard time making extra noises by hitting the microphone. Alright, now 500 calories. Yes. So if this makes me sick, that's not the worst thing. But I then I'm rid of it. Okay, not sick. Very good. There's so many crackers. So many teas and coffees. And... Like, this is an ideal backpack for food and water for me. Alright, anyway. Let's get the sleep that we need. And then... Oh, an Aurora. Um, okay. Well, slept right through that. Good stuff. I think I will step outside, though. Just because I want to see... The weather is like my crouched. Yes, I am. Sometimes the bear is out here, so that'll be interesting. But yeah, I wanted to get a look and see what the weather's like. Hopefully, it's, I don't think it's windy or a blizzard because I don't hear anything. Come on, load screen. I think that is this that looks like uh oh sorry i was gonna say that picture looked like i think it was timberwolf mountain hey, i might be wrong okay there you are so foggy looks like the fog is lifting a little bit let's see if i can get a i think this is a vista location but it might be a polaroid location so let's see if it'll let me do this it will awesome 
And I've already marked this area. Good enough. Cool. Well, that's fine. I'm probably going to go back inside to get the save, but I'm going to end it before there. All right, so I'm going to have to put those things in here eventually. The wires and such. I Ooh, pry bar. Cool. Actually. Yeah, we'll leave this one here. Hopefully I'll remember that that's there. I don't want to bring it inside and then forget I have it in my backpack. And then haul it all the way everywhere. But, anyway, this is Strategies with Sasquatch. I'm Josh, and yeah, we'll see you next time. Looks like a new day is dawning. Thanks for watching.